la gente que sí dice. Good evening, everyone. Good evening, good evening. Good night, teacher. Hi, good evening. How was it? Good evening, teacher. Hey, guys, teacher. how are you? How are you? I'm on my way. Are you driving? Yeah. All right, all right, all right. All right. I am fine, thank you for asking. I feel better in comparison with yesterday. Yesterday I was not, I mean, I was emotionally okay, uh, but not, I was physically bad. I felt a weak. I felt uh, like as if I didn't, I didn't want to do anything. But today I feel better, especially because it is Friday, you know, <laughs> it's, it's better. And I'm going to, I actually, uh, I spent my, my whole afternoon resting. I felt, uh, uh, like I told you, yesterday I was feeling bad. Today I was feeling still not that bad, but I I took advantage of my, my afternoon off and I kind of rested for a couple of hours. So right now I feel okay. I'm okay. Thank you guys for asking and thank you guys for joining. And uh, well, let me tell you that today is Friday. Yes. <laughs> right. We gotta we gotta celebrate. Look at this. Yes. We gotta celebrate. Today is Friday. And uh we know it. We know it. Tell me, what about you? How is everything? How are you? How is life treating you? How is your job? How is your family? What's going on? Tell me. Good evening, teacher. How are you? What like was what you, you sick with? You. No, you. What was uh, you sick with? My problem. Yes. Oh, I health don't know. problem. I don't, really, I don't really know what was happening to me yesterday. Uh, I was okay in the morning, but like around 11 or 12, 11 a.m. or 12 p.m., I started to feel uh, weird, kind of uh, anxious, physically weak. Uh, I got this allergy as well, this cough, very bad cough. My eyes burned. Uh, uh, what's the word? My eyes uh, itched. This is them. Let me help you out. Itched. That's the word over there in the, the chat. Itched. It's like you like when your eyes uh burn and hurt a lot. Yes. Yes. Oh. So I, was, I was like this. I was like this. So I couldn't. I couldn't turn off my camera because I was like this. My eyes hurt. I had an allergy reaction. I was not physically okay. And uh, I don't really know what's ha what was happening to me. And today, like I said, I feel a lot better. <laughs> Thank you. Mauricio, tell me what about That's how good. with you? How how is life treating you? How was your job? This week, uh, particularly, has been very hard, especially yeah. traveling every day by by bus. Uh, my car, as I told you, will be uh, for a uh, fifteen day fifteen days. Uh, ¿Cómo se dice en reparación? Repair, in repair. In, re in repairance. And so I need to, to move in, in, or to travel in, in, by bus, by bus. All right. Well, I think it's, it, it's an adventure, you know. You go back to your uh, previous self. I mean, uh, I know maybe, but I don't really know, right? But maybe sometime in the past or some point in the past, you travel by bus or you used to, use, used to travel by bus, right? So you're just going back to back in time, traveling, you know, having a, a going back to the adventure. <laughs> it's it's the the problem is that I don't remember uh, um, what bus uh, I must okay. take to okay. to move to a, to a place. 
and that is difficult, but either way. Yeah, yeah, you're right, you're right. And I'm sorry that you're having a hard week, that you've been having a hard week at, at work. Sometimes you have easy weeks, sometimes it's hard, sometimes it's boring. Like for me, this this past, well, this week, because we the end the week ended today for me. It was a little boring. It was not really difficult. It was easy, but it was more boring than easy. And uh, I think this week coming up, uh, from Monday to Friday next week, is going to be even more boring because uh, I I will get no students. I'm just going to go to the school and just be there by myself. Not by myself, right? I'm going to have my my uh, uh, my coworkers. They're going to be there with me. But still, uh, being with no students, you think you feel like like the the, the whole morning uh, takes a lot of time. <laughs> yes. Like that. Thank you guys for joining. I know it's Friday. Yes. And uh, well, it's 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 good to be here. Katya, how are you, Katya? How is everything? Hi, Welcome teacher. Session. <laughs> How's everything? I think that I'm fine. I will <laughs> uh with my family in tonight and taking the class and just to good this Friday, <laughs> right? Yeah. Finally, finally Friday. Friday. All right, all right. And how was your, your day at work? Uh, good. Uh, today I finished my project. Uh, well, I give my check of Vista Bueno. I don't know how to say it in English. The what? Uh, Vista Bueno. And what is that? Uh, when you are agree with the... Um, the things that you do in the project. For example, uh, you say, I'm okay with that. Hmm. It's like B O B O. Approval. Approval. Okay. 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 Thank you. All right. So I, I think that that is better for me these days. All right. When I finish my, my project. Yeah. <laughs> But you, you finished it, right? What? You finished it, right? Yeah, today. Hmm. I, I I have the deadline. <laughs> okay. Well, so I okay. did. Yeah, so I did it, and now I am more relaxed. Can okay, you feel? At least in my more, mind. <laughs> you feel more more relaxed. Uh, there's a peace in your mind. <laughs> yes. All right. All right. Yeah. Yes, yeah. I have been there. That's right. Know? Sometimes we have uh, too much pressure. We do not know what to do. And uh, we always find a way to, to get out of this situation. And uh, I'm happy that you're done with your project, that uh, you're feeling relaxed now, that your your mind is, you know, finally resting. <laughs> yeah, because uh, this week I was uh, a backup. Uh, and the the project, so the project manager, and so I was with the, a lot of things to do in, in the work, and my computer died the Monday. I don't know many things to me. All right, all right, I get it, I get it. Well, thank you for for joining, Katya. Excellent. Thank you for being here today. Thank yes. you. Thank you to you. All right. Okay. Very good. Very good. Mauricio, how is everything, Mauricio? How are you? Tell me, what's going on with you? Well, today was great in my job. Uh, wow, a lot of different it. about yesterday, because yesterday I had a lot of angry customers with different uh, issues and problems. But today was great because I... I achieved a lot of uh, customers and I sell... I sold some uh, planning packages, uh, but at the morning when I got my car, I lost my key in, inside the car. So oh. I, I spent around one hour in my garage 
to resolve that because I called the 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 I called my 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 mechanic, but uh, uh, he doesn't have uh, the 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 tools to to open the door. So I I had to research on my on my cell phone for another contact, and at the uh, at the end I resolved after one hour with the car on. So I lost gas. Wow. Yes, uh, <laughs> but uh, after that I just uh, arrived to my job and 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 I had to 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 use my uh, my my lunch hour to to recover the to recover the time and only that. But I don't I don't have a bad day. Just that inconvenience, but uh, is that okay for me? Uh, uh, I try. I don't uh, don't feel bad. I or I try don't the don't get stress stress or something yes. like that. It goes to this Friday in the body now. Exactly, exactly. Yes, yes. It's just a minor a minor issue that should not like give you any problems. I mean, it happens. It's normal. So uh, I but well, it's happened to me. More than three times, I think I've been in that situation like five or six times. I I, I forget the, the, the key in the car. I, ha I have two keys. There, there, were, there have been two times. There have been two times in which I have forgotten the car, the two keys in the car. Yes. Just think about that. <laughs> both, both of them in the car. Yeah, yes. Yes, yes of and course. I have, uh -huh. Yes. I have hired the, the locksmith. And this person charges from fifteen to twenty dollars to open it. Yes. 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 I I don't have any problem with the door. Just uh, I mentioned it yesterday. I have problem with the ship. Yes. So you told me. <clears throat> so when I turn on turn on the car, always close the doors because I I I have to open the the uh my garage, but uh today the key uh activated. Uh, alone, uh, alone, yes, uh huh, without any manipulation for me, and that was the 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 problem. So when I tried to open the the the, the car, the 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 door was locked. Was locked. Locked. Yes. 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 yes only, only, only that. But for another uh, situation, uh, all was uh, all yes, all 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 day it was good. Oh, I, I, yes, we we have to learn learn uh from this kind of situation that sometimes we worry too much, we get angry, we get frustrated, and it's something that we should not even worry about. I mean, it happens. It's a mistake yes. that can happen to anyone in any day, and uh, well, you just well when when uh when that happens to me, I just smile and laugh, you know, <laughs> like. I mean, there is nothing I can do. If I get angry, why am I gonna get angry? Like, there yeah, is no reason I, for, I, for that. I think, I think that uh, when something like that happened, uh, it's like it's like a God um, sent a, a message, like, uh, okay, stop, take it easy, and something, something probably going to happen if you run or if you go to the street now and, and I try to think that and I know that all all is it's okay I don't have another option and there's there's a there's a phrase everything happens for a reason yes that is correct yes, everything happens for a reason all right well I'm glad that you are here how are you thank you for joining yes and welcome all right let me see. Uh, well, what about Eric? How is Eric doing? Eric, are you there? No, <laughs> I don't think so. Hello. Nice. Hey, how are you, Eric? Good evening. Uh, I'm having my dinner. No. Are you having dinner right now? All right, all right. Of course. Enjoy. Enjoy your dinner. For sure. Thank you. Thank you, easy. Thank you, easy. All right. Enjoy your dinner. Get some water or a cup of coffee and just... Some beer. 
Masters because it's Friday and the body knows. Exactly, exactly. Yes. <laughs> very good, very good. I I won't take you a word and uh, interrupt with your dinner time. Go ahead and do it. Marilyn, how are you with your knee? How is everything going? If you cannot speak, let me know what's going on with you in the chat. How is your knee, your ligament problem? Hello, I was fine. Thank you. Do you have less pain now? Yeah. Do you have less pain now? No. Does it hurt? Yeah. A lot? No. So you, you, you cannot, can you walk? No, this time, no. I can't participate. Right yeah. You, you cannot walk right now? Right now, no. I I go out to 10, 10 p.m. All right, all right. Well, Marilyn, I, I wish you the best with your uh with your ligament ligament problem. Yes. I wish you recovery, soon recovery, yes. I know it, it hurts. It's difficult to be like that. You know, I've been there. Yes, it, it's hard. It's really, really hard. All right. Mario, are you going to be as a listener? Let me know. Because I see the, the word before your name. Stephanie, how are you, Stephanie? How is everything? Hello, good evening. Everything is okay. Thank you. All right. How was your day? Good, bad, more or less? Um, it was a good day. I'm still working and it is um, how can I express that it is like tranquilo? Calm, relaxing. Okay, it's calm. Yes. Yes. A relaxing day, an easy yes. day. Yes. yes. What time are you done with the with the, with your job today? Uh ten p.m. All right, ten p.m. And yes. are you working home? Are you yes, doing some home, home. home office? Yes. Oh, okay. Guess yeah, because driving or going to your house at that time is is kind of dangerous. <laughs> yes, but but it's home office. Okay. All right. All right. Well, I'm glad. Are you going to be available for participation? Uh if I uh don't receive calls. I I will be able to participate. All right, all right. Yes. Well, I will ask you. I will ask you for participation. If you cannot really speak, don't do it. All right. If you can, just okay. go for it. Yes. Okay. Thank you. Okay. Very good. Very good. Well, I saw Raúl over here. He left. I don't know what happened to him. Miguel, are you still driving? Yes, Charlie still driving, but I I am a few a few kilometers to get oh, my home. Get to your house, all right. Yes, all right. that's that's good. That's good. And what time are, are you are you done with your job? What time do you finish? Uh, so uh, today I I work late because because that. Oh okay okay I get it I get it. What time but, do you start? <laughs> like around uh, nine a.m. or ten a.m. I'm start working at seven a.m. But after after five after five o'clock is uh, overtime. You do extra hours. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. But that's that's up to you then. That's <laughs> your decision, right? Okay. okay. Yeah. That's good. That's good. If you're doing extra hours, yes. I have done extra hours. I mean, sometimes you have. Uh, I mean, in my situation. I have come to my house and I have just uh, got my phone in my hands and started doing some Facebooking or Instagramming or tweeting and tweeting and so in, doing some TikToking, you know. And uh, I, instead of doing that on social media, I should be working, you know. So that's why I'm here right now. Yes, I could be like like using my cell phone, uh, but if I have the chance to work. A few hours, uh, well, why not? Why not? Yes, why not? Okay, okay thanks. All right. Luis Castillo, how are you, Luis? Long, long time not hearing from you. What's going on? Uh, 
What's going on, Luis? Are you okay? Javier Castillo, let me see what's going on. I don't know. Okay, I will be as a listener. Emerson won't be here today due to a family issue. <laughs> Sorry. Okay, my bad. Uh, let's see. All right, Luis, I know that you're going to be as a listener right now. Thank you for joining. Thank you for joining. And uh, people, we're about to start. There are a few things that we need to cover today. And uh, we're going to be talking about simple, uh, I mean, uh, report speech. We're going to continue talking about report speech, but we're going to take it to a different not a different level. We're going to kind of continue with what we were doing yesterday. Uh, questions, but not just no questions. We're gonna do it or work with the uh, WH questions or information questions such as which, where, what, who, what time, etc. All of those questions we're gonna be using them, and we're gonna be learning how to report those questions in simple past, past perfect, and using would. The same structures as of yesterday. Now, let me take attendance. Hold on, I need something here. <laughs> Sorry. Wow, oh no. Wow, I'm sorry, Marilyn. But which ligament is it? Because uh, uh, my uh the one that I have torn that uh, torn is the one in the middle. It's called uh Spanish ligamento anterior cruzado. That's the one I have uh, I have problems with. Yes, that one is torn, my ligament. And uh, sometimes if I do exercise or if I practice sports, I damage it. But uh, if I don't do anything, if I just walk, I work, I do my things, I take it easy, it doesn't give me any problems. But I cannot do any physical, like I cannot run, I cannot do any sports, I cannot do exercise, I, can, or I, I cannot like... I, uh, climb, climb a tree or something like that, or go up in a ladder. I cannot do anything, any of that. Yes. Well, uh, I wish you, I wish, oh, Jesus, I cannot run this. I cannot, like, oh, my God. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yes, you're going to get a surgery. You're going to get a surgery. Get ready for the surgery. I have read a lot of uh, posts, articles about, and I have watched uh, videos about the surgery and uh, the process. Uh, I mean, the process doesn't hurt because you know they they uh, they give you medicine for for that. But after that, after the surgery is the difficult part because it hurts a lot. So get ready. Get ready. I wish you the best. I know it won't be easy, but I know you're gonna get through this situation. And I just wish you the best with it with your knee problem. Uh, let me see. Diego Josue Benitez, no, is not here. Elizabeth Stephanie Vasquez Ramirez, present. That's right. Thank you. Emerson won't be here today due to a family problem. Eric Enrique Reyes Martinez. I'm here. Thank you, Julissa Emilia Villalta Villalta. I don't know what's going on with this person. Katia Ivania, Carla Ivania, sorry. Ana Ancheta. Now here, Katia Maria Gonzalez Alvarenga. Present, teacher. Thank you. Luis Fabricio Tobar Ramos. Present, teacher. All right, thank you, thank you. Luis Javier Castillo.
Ok, Magdiel Esaú García Morales. Marilyn Alejandra Grande Pérez, yes, you, 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 you're here. Mario Ernesto Ramírez. Mauricio Edgardo Soriano. I'm here. Yes, you are. Rafael Alberto Herrera Moreno, he's not here today. Raúl Edgardo Muñoz de Sí. All right, Ronald, no, and uh, this person has never been. Okay, we got it, we got it. Thank you guys for joining. I have uh, this allergy problem again. All right. Thank you, Mario, for uh, writing in the chat. Marilyn, thank you, too. Thank you, thank you. OK, we're going to start uh, with the session. And uh, let me share today's cover. This is for today's session. It's, it's day number nine or class number nine. It's a uh, Friday, as you know. And yep, yeah, we're gonna start. Yes, let me start by sharing uh, the activity, this activity that we did not finish yesterday. This one uh, on page number 18. Yes, you have it. Vocab uh, building vocabulary. We got six words here that you might not know what they mean. If you do know what they mean, that's fine. Uh, yes, it says there, match the terms related to online shopping to the corresponding meanings. All right. And let me read the words and then I'm going to read the definitions and I'm going to help you out with the vocabulary if needed. Uh, number one, reliable seller. Two is fake review. Three is rating or rating. Uh, number four is warranty. Number five is faulty. And the last one is skeptical. Yes. Uh, you might have a question uh, about warranty. What's the difference between... Uh, Those two words, can you see them in the chat? Can you see them in the chat? Yes. yes. I don't what's, know the difference. What's the difference? What is the difference? It's basically this. The word warranty with W, W-A-R-R, double R, A-N-T-Y, warranty. That one is for the what you get what you get after buying or shopping something. For example, sometimes you get uh, let's say you get a stereo. You get a stereo and they give you a three month warranty. It's a piece of paper that that allows you to change the stereo just in case it is damaged or in bad conditions or it stops working during those three months, you can take it back to the store. They can either fix it or give you a different stereo. That's the warranty. And guarantee, listen to that, Gu guarantee. Warranty, guarantee. Guarantee is the verb. Is the verb, is the action. It's like saying promise in Spanish, promise. All right. But let me give you an example right there to help you out understanding better. Yes. Look, I got a two year
Look at this. I got a two year warranty for my TV. I got a two year warranty for my TV. Well, this is not possible. They don't give you that, that much time. They don't give you that much time. And uh, down here, I'm going to write the example with a uh, guarantee. I make you will say. Satisfy you. Look, I guarantee, I guarantee this TV will satisfy you. Yes. So, what is this in Spanish? War, uh, I mean, warranty is in Spanish garantia. And the guarantee is garantizar, prometer. Yes. That is the difference. Do you understand it? Yes. Yes. yes sure. I got all right. It. All right. Excellent. Excellent. Uh, the well, reliable seller. Uh, reliable is like trust, trusty or trustworthy. That's reliable. Someone who uh, to whom you can trust. Right. That's reliable. Fake review rating warranty. I mean guarantee. Faulty and skeptical. Let me read the definitions and then you do the matching. Working badly or unreliably because of imperfections, feedback and comments about hold on. Feedback and comments about a third party seller focused on the buying experience, not easily convinced, having doubts or reservations, positive or negative feedback about a product or service written or paid by brands or sellers, a seller you can trust with your purchases and who, who is consistently good in delivering quality of products and a formal assurance that, a cer that certain conditions will be fulfilled relating to a product or service. There you go. We have the, the, the words or the terms. We've got the terms over here, and we have the definitions. I'm going to give you three minutes, three or four minutes to do the matching. I mean, uh, you're going to find out what reliable seller is. You're going to read the definitions and you're going to decide which one is or which definition goes with reliable seller. All right. Let me give you three. Let me give you three or four minutes to do this. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go for it. Yes. Let me get some water. I'm thirsty right now. You got it, got it.
Guys, are you ready now? Almost. You think so, teacher? You think so? What about the rest? Yes. What about the rest? Yes. Um, the first is faulty. Get easy, then get easy. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Sorry. Let's see. Uh, thank you, Diego. Thank you. Yeah, you're right. You're right. It is that one. It is that one. But we're gonna go uh like like uh in order, like one by one. The first one is reliable seller. Read the term and read the definition for that term, please. I volunteer for the first one. Reliable teacher. seller. Okay, read it. Uh, I think it goes with a seller you can trust with your. Uh, purchases and who is consistently good in delivering quality of products. Okay, which one is that one? The first one, reliable seller. All right, all right. Guys, do you agree with Fabricio? Yes. Yes, Fabricio was reading uh, the, the five one. Yes, this. Okay, so reliable seller, a seller you can trust with your purchases and who is consistently good in delivering quality to your products or of your products. All right, thank you for reading. Let's continue with fake review. Please read the term and read and then read the definition. Another volunteer. Me, teacher. Thank fake you, Diego. Go for it. Fake review. Feedback and comments about a third-party seller focused on the buying experience. You're saying that it is the one next to it? Yes. People, do you agree with Diego? I disagree, teacher. You disagree? I disagree as well. I believe, but I not I don't sure if the fake review nor easily convinced having doubts or reservation. No, no, that's skeptical. That yes, that's skeptical. Exactly. Yes, yeah. uh, for that's me, skeptical. coach, fake review is like a positive or negative feedback about a product or service rating or paid by brands or sellers. Exactly, exactly. That's the one. Yes, that's the one. It's okay. Don't worry about it, Diego. It's okay to 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 make mistakes sometimes. So, fake. That's what it says there. Fake. That is not real. Fake review. Positive or negative feedback about a product or service written or paid. Look, written or paid by brands or sellers. It means that the, the review is not real because it's it has been written by another company, you know, for the competition, or the company, the company has paid people to write reviews, positive reviews about something. Yes. And it, this is very common. This is very common. Some the, the, the same company, the same company pays people to write good reviews about the, the the product in order to get more and more sales. I'm telling you because I have uh, read, I have read this type of uh, reviews. Yes. And uh, it's like uh, some uh, kind of machine is writing the comments because it's the same, the same thing, the same. You can see the pattern uh, in the comments that it's the same. People are writing the same, like commenting the same. It's just a powder, and you can see that the comments are really fake. Yes. All right. So that's the second one. Number three, ratings or ratings. Anyone read the, the term and read the definition. Well, for me, ratings is feedback and comments about a third party sellers focused on the buying experience. Okay. Let's see that one. 
feedback and comments about a third party seller focused on the buying experience. Three, right? Yes. Guys, do you agree with Mauricio? Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Okay. I was confused. It's okay to get confused. It's, it's, it's not a problem. Yes. Don't worry about it, man. Don't worry. Don't worry. It's it's normal. It's part of the process. All right. And uh, number four, guarantee. Guarantee. Read the term and read the definition. People, anyone? Me, teacher. Thank you, Katya. Excellent. Okay. Guarantee. A pharma assurance that certain conditions will be filtered relating to a product or service. All right. Guys, do you agree with Katya? Yes. Yes. Teacher. Yes. Yes. Katya is right, and you guys are right as well. The guarantee is a formal assurance that certain conditions will be fulfilled relating to a product or service. Yes. Be careful with this word. Uh, is certain. You can say certain, but I, I think it's better to say certain. The same as the word, uh, some people will say written because it is easy to say. But if you want to sound better, you have to say written, written. You don't really pronounce the double T. You just pronounce written, written, written. The same happens with the word certain, certain. Yes. And there are many words that you can pronounce like that, or you pronounce like that. Certain, uh, written, eaten, curtain, mountain. There are many words that you pronounce like that. Number five, faulty. People, can you help me out with this term? Read the term and the definition. It's allergies. Faulty teacher, working badly or unreliable, unreliable, yes, unreliably, because yes, unreliable. imperfections. Okay, five. Guys, do you agree with Diego? Yes, I agree. Yes. Yes, working badly or un unreliably because of imperfections. Yes. And skeptical, skeptical is the last one. What is this? Anyone? Read it, read it. It's difficult. <laughs> it's, it's difficult. We don't know, right? We have any options. Guys, anyone? Read it. Just read it. You know the answer. Sure. Okay, go for it. Not easily convinced, uh, having doubts or reservations. Exactly. Not easily convinced, having doubts or reservations. Yes, that's what it is. I just got the allergy again. I don't know why. Yes, I'm I'm sneezing right now. Uh, and I got uh, some nasal problems. I think it's because I had this. I don't know. I have this fun, and I was using it earlier. I didn't have get any problems. I just got the allergy. I think that again. is the is the the change of the weather. Probably. Jesus. I think that you need alcohol to drink. <laughs> oh yes, yes. Today is Friday, and we can go to the chapute. Oh, <laughs> yeah. It 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 is uh it is possible, right? Yeah, the body knows it. <laughs> the body knows it. Everybody knows it. All right, guys. Do you have any questions about this part number four? We got six words. Do you have any questions about it? No. Okay, now we're going to have a five-minute activity. This activity consists of you writing an example for each word. I mean, you are going to write an example with reliable seller, with fake review, rating, guarantee, faulty, and skeptical. So you're going to have six examples at the end. All right, and for this, I'm going to set the, set the time and I'm going to give you five minutes. Okay, the timer, timer, see. So we're gonna start writing examples. You can use any structure you want. 
You can uh, use any structure you want, whatever example you want. As long as you use the word uh, level seller for review, it's okay, right? It's okay. I'm going to be writing some examples in the chat so you can see how, how you can do it, all right? Five minutes starting now. Let's go. Teacher, a sentence that includes the terms uh, exactly, exactly at the beginning? Oh, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter. I just need an example, a sentence in which you are including the six words. So you're gonna okay. have you're gonna have six examples or six sentences. Okay, perfect.
Okay. I just gave you some examples of what you can do in the with examples with the words. Yes. In the Zoom chat, you can find them there. Guys, are you ready? One more minute, teacher, please. I'm done, teacher. I think everybody is ready. Like we're gonna start sharing examples. Let me stop sharing this. We're gonna do it here. All right, let's begin. I volunteer. Share your examples. Share your examples. One example or In how all, many? No, all, of, all of them. Okay. Go. So, With the first first word uh, or the first term, reliable seller. I wrote, uh, you always search when, you, when you're shopping for a reliable seller. Yes. Number okay. two, don't trust everything you read because of fake reviews. Okay. Number three, the product's rating is a good review of that you buy. Number four, make sure what you buy uh, what you buy guarantees your complete satis satisfaction. Number five is some product is faulty, don't worry, use the warranty. Exactly right. The last one, uh, if you are skeptical, then you should test to be sure. Okay, perfect examples. Thank you for sharing them. Let's continue with another volunteer, guys. Share your examples.
I have some example about the the, the worst. Okay. Well, well share them. My mom wants to buy a new cell phone online, but it's too exceptionally skeptical. Mm -hmm. Yes. A TV is faulty after two years when the warranty ends. End. End or end? Ends. Ends, yes. And okay, okay. Uh, uh, I'm a little skeptical, skeptical when I bought my new car, but the seller gave me his guarantee. Okay. Okay. I checked some page online to get a new house, but I detected a lot of fake reviews. All right. I decided to buy in this store after check the ratings. All right. Yes, only that. Okay, thank you for sharing your examples. They were good, they were perfect. Thank you, Mauricio. Let's continue. We still have, uh, oh, Diego is here. Marilyn cannot really practice right now. Katia, Elizabeth, Magdiel. Okay, teacher. Hi. Yes, Katia. Go ahead, Katia. Thank you. Okay, my first sample is um, Maria was efficient and re reliable seller in her first day of the work. Yes. I continue? Okay. Uh, the second is, I saw many good comments on the post. I think they, are, they must be a fake news. All right. I want a high raisins this month in my business. It is holiday season. Okay, good. The next, the next, Siman warranties some products, not all. Um, next, my TV is bad. I only have two days since I bought it. I need to use the warranty. And the last one, I am so skeptical with the online products. Okay. You, okay. you got it wrong with warranty though, because warranty is the, is the, with WWA, warrant. The word that we have here is guarantee, gu guarantee, which is the verb, the verb. And warranty is the noun. I mean, the document that you, the piece of paper that they give you, that's the warranty. And the gu and guarantee is the verb, the action. So change it. If you have got the sentence is correct, uh -huh. yes, but you have to use the word warranty, not guarantee, right there. Yes, but uh, in the sentence that I said, my TV is bad and I only have two days since I bought it. I need to use the warranty. Okay, then it is correct. It is correct. I was just okay. telling you because may maybe you you have you had a guarantee because the pronunciation sounds similar. And this one, this one that we have here is guarantee. And the other one is warranty. Okay. Thank so you, you got it correct. You got it correct. Don't worry about it. Thank you for sharing. Okay. Let's continue. Let's see. Diego, are you ready? No, teacher, no. <clears throat> Give me a moment, please. All right. Magdiel, what about you? Mm -hmm. Not yet, teacher. I, I work in that. Yes, I working on it. All right. Elizabeth, do you have any examples? What about you, Raul? Edgardo? That one is not there. How many, how many do you have, Diego? Don't worry, share the ones that you have. If you have two, two or three, that's okay, share them.
Okay. Thank you. I bought a cell phone that was faulty and I did use the warranty. Oh, yeah, okay. Miguel, how many do you have? If you have only one or two, go ahead, share them. Okay, now we're going to continue working with this and we have your turn. Fair work, interview 50% of the class about their online shopping experiences. Use the questions in the chart below as a reference. Add any other follow-up follow question you like. There are six questions and there are going to be, or there are uh, six different partners, but we're not going to do it like that. We're going to do it in couples or in pairs. Yes. Let me read the questions. And if you have a, a question about the vocabulary, let me know. Have you ever bought something online? What was it? Did you read some reviews before buying your product or service? Were they useful? Three. Did the provider offer a guarantee in case? Hold oh, on. Did the provider offer a guarantee? Hold oh, on. I just want to check something here. Because this, I think, this is incorrect. But you never stop learning, so maybe I am wrong. Teacher warranty, it's a yes. verb. Yes, that's what I'm trying to find over here. Guarantee, sorry. Guarantee, it's a verb, and warranty, it's guarantee. Exactly, yes, you're right. I'm, I'm reading, I'm reading. No, actually, it works. It works like that, yes. Let me, let me show you. Let me show you. Let me show you. Well, I did not know that. And it's something really easy to know, but I didn't know. I mean, it's okay. Look at this. Yes. Look. The waffle iron comes with a five-year uh, guarantee. Yeah, yeah, it works. It works like that. Well, I use it as a verb only, look, as a verb, like this. Okay, it is correct then, it is correct, yes. Let's check the other one out. It's correct then, wow. I did not know that. And this one, yeah, look. That's what it is. Okay, very good. And it's fine, it's fine. Wow, you never stop learning. Okay, did the provider offer a, a guarantee in case you were not satisfied with the product? Were you skeptical about the quality of the product you, you would receive? And did you experience any issues to make the, uh, the payment? And the last one, have you or your friends had a bad experience when shopping online? Let's do this. I'm going to pair you up right now. I'm going to pair you up and I'm going to give you around seven minutes to well, five or seven. I know some of you are not really available. Some of you are not available for, for participation. Don't worry, I will not consider you uh, in the groups. Teacher, I have a I have a question. I'm confused. Okay, tell me, ask me. Uh, so uh, both terms, uh, guarantee and warranty, are the same meaning. Yes, yes, I can see that they are the same. 
they are the same. But uh, there's one thing here. Warranty with W, you cannot use it as a verb. You cannot use it as a verb. Only guarantee can be used as a verb. So guarantee with G, guarantee with G, you can use it as a noun to refer to the object, to the piece of paper, or to the action, like promise, yes. But warranty, no. Warranty is only the piece of paper. It's not the, the other thing. Okay, okay, thank you. But they are basically the same, yes. That's kind of weird. Number here, I'm going to do this and that only. Uh, Raul, I'm going to pair you up with Magdiel. Please, guys, work together. I need you. I need you to work on the on this activity. This activity over here, the one that I just uh show you, the what was the name of it? What well, it doesn't have a name. It's the questions. The six questions. You're gonna ask your partner the questions, and then your partner is going to ask you the questions, and you're going to answer them. All right? Yes. And then we're gonna be trying to share those answers. With the entire class so i'm going to take you yes sorry can you show the questions please yes let me see if you can uh share the well you can share them now here this ones these are the questions this ones so you're going to ask your partner these questions and then your partner is going to ask you the same questions and you're going to answer them. You can answer them either in your on your books or on a piece of paper, right? On your notebook, or if you have a note notepad, you can write it, write the answers on that. Yes, no problem. Okay, so we're gonna we're gonna be working on this. So guys, let's do this. Let me see. All right, let me stop sharing, and let me create them. Okay, go. Join them, please. Join them. Have you ever bought have you ever bought something online? Yes. <laughs> what was um I I never do a online online a compra. You Wait. can say purchase. I online purchase. You can purchase. Okay, thank you, teacher. Purchase. Uh, well, I never do a international purchase because I'm very skeptical about that. But I, 
if I can say uh, I buy online, it is about medical products, for example, uh, from a pharmacy or things uh, from Simang, uh, things like that in my case. Oh, only here in El Salvador? Uh, yes, she local. Has, <laughs> she has money from Simang? Wow. <laughs> yes. I a lot of money, right. teacher. Yes. <laughs> okay, you reach? No, no, no. <laughs> the, the, last time, <laughs> the last time I bought something in Siman, I think that it was a chocolate or something like that. Chocolate. Okay. Really? <laughs> okay. And yes, I bought uh but I I have ever bought it, teacher. No. I have ever bought. I have never what? No, I have ever. A no, no, I, I have, have never. I have never. I have always. Is it? Pero si quiero decir, he comprado. I have. Yo, I have. I have bought. I have bought. That way. Okay, I have bought a, a lot of things. For example, <laughs> cases for my phone. Oh. Or I bought a. a it's a piece of plastic to fix my pencil. My um, it it this name is my S pen. It's a pen that my phone has. Mm. Yes, and the the la punta. No sé cómo se dice. The, I don't know. The, yes, the tip, and I I I lose the 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 tip, and I had to 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 buy. Another one. Oh, okay. Another one. Yes. Uh, okay. Did you uh, read? Did you read some reviews before buying your product or service? Yes. yes. Uh, it's, it's a. It's a toy. Yes, it's a toy. Who do you mention? This a toy, and I I saw the I saw the review. Comentarios, ¿cómo se dice? Perdón. Comments or review. Comments or review. Ah, okay. Comments or review. Cualquiera de las dos. Yes. yes. Okay. I saw the plenty of reviews about the, the the toy. I remember the review is good about the, the toys. It is the little Batman and beautiful beautiful toy. For you, or for your son, for me, <laughs> okay. I collection Collect. toys. The Batman, Collect. Batman toys, Batman toys. I. Do you have another, other toy, a little toy? And um, all the Batman. Todos sobre Batman. Guys, continue. Okay. In my case, uh, in my case, I never, I never have bought something online. I have never bought. I have never bought. I have never bought something online. I just um, only only use uh, pedidos ya. Yeah. Okay. I remember my friends had a bad experience when shopping online because my my bad friends 
ordered ordered or ordered ordered with ed because ordered. it's past form yes okay ordered the new June the new airpods the new iphone 15 wow <laughs> <laughs> The new airpods and he he never he never come you <sighs> you airpods so they were and never she, delivered yes wow never delivered right. he he paid i remember he paid to two hundred dollars yeah, they cost like that. Yes. Expensive. All right. Guys, you, I'm going you to might see you later. have you writing, writing too. I'm not too bad. Uh, like... Something like, hi. Hi, teacher. Hey. Yes, uh, I checked the, the, the manual and I didn't have that page. So... I have it, but I can I can share in the in the chat. Okay, I have it now. Perfect. Okay, uh, Luis, have you ever bought something online? And really, why? really not. Okay, why? You are except uh, skeptical. No, I prefer always to go personally to a physical store. Uh, you didn't, I'm didn't that have kind of a, person. any. You didn't have any necessary to to buy something online. That is impossible. Uh, maybe food. That. Oh yeah. Oh okay. Does that is is by online? That's right. That's yes. right. Technically, technically <laughs> yes. speaking, yes. It is. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about uh, other kind of products like yeah, uh, yeah. accessories or something like that. Yes. Yes. Okay. Perfect. And I don't know uh, the same question for me or, or what? Yeah. Uh, yes, I think so. Have you ever bought something online? Yes. What was uh, it? Yes, I bought online some a lot of things. But I consider that for me, uh, check the product online or or try to buy something is just to compare prices. Cause like you, I prefer to buy physically. And when I don't have option, uh, when the when the when the seller told me tell me, hey, I'm sorry, but I don't have a physical store. Uh, I I need to 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 buy, but but for me, I prefer to ask first. Uh, do you have a physical store? And go to the store, and and try to to get something like that. But for me, it's a great option to buy online because sometimes you can get a great discount or buy something different or something product that you don't have on on, on the store in the stores. Uh, or you don't have in this country, uh, actually. Um, uh, but I don't like to buy online in another country because uh, we have to wait a lot of times to receive the products. That's and, right. And sometimes the products never arrived and you have to put a, a, a claim and ask about your product. Receive? Um, I think oh, well. I yeah, yes the first time yes but then I am um, um at first I I read a lot of commentaries or reviews to know if um really it is a a, a product or if the product is um good as I want it Mm. Okay. Mm -hmm. Well, I I think that I in the face of to be very skeptical with the 
to, to make my first international purchase <laughs> with my user, for example. Uh, well, I have things that my friends, my sisters, uh, buy to me uh, with the international platforms, but I am not the, the person that I directly pay the, the purchase. I only be the beneficiary. <laughs> I I can I can play the, the things, but I don't know the, the user that make the, the purchase. But um I think I, I am skeptical <laughs> about that for that. Okay, I, I think that at the beginning uh, buying in it um my first care was um put my my credit card my debit card because i don't have credit card my debit card in the in the platform because i was thinking if it uh, discount the money but the product didn't come or don't come sorry um what can i say what can i do this mm -hmm. is the, the first um, scary when you buy um, in an in international on an international platform. Yeah. Include uh, when you buy local with the internet is... The platform did not work. Um, I... I I try and try and try the the carry out the carry out payment is uh, the carry out payment and I couldn't, I couldn't. And you, did you experience any issue, issues to make the payment on or your friends? I bought a refrigerator uh, nowadays, but the seller said me that the refrigerator <clears throat> has a uh, 10 years of warranty but he the the seller don't explain that this the warranty is only some parts some parts of the specific or the refrigerator not this completely and uh, the warranty com completely is only one year. But the brand give uh, 10 years only in the compressor, compressor of the system, system cooling. But I think uh, some sometimes there are uh, some sellers that they don't ex don't explain um, exactly or uh, exactly that that uh, that warranty and when the when the product uh, has issues uh, in and I go to the ¿Cómo se dice reclamar la garantía? Sorry. Claim. Reclama. Claim the warranty. Reclam Sorry. Claim. Claim the warranty. Claim the Thank warranty. Yes. Uh, and so they say uh, the product doesn't have doesn't have warranty. Okay. Because there are there are many 
closest, a little closest that when when I buy when I buy the product, I I don't I don't see this this clauses. Okay. Where you where you skeptical? Yes. Skeptical. Sorry, repeat. Skeptical. Skeptical about the quality of the product you would receive. The restaurant and get the and get the pizzas and you you can uh, get your warranty because uh, uh, we we have a lot of time to provide the the service. Um, but uh, in that that case is in the pizza Bernal. But I remember oh, when yeah. I when I go pizza another pizza for the same the same brand, and the manager told me no, we don't have that option for you. And because you both you you will buy a lot of pizza and we don't have the warranty you will receive the pizza in thirty minutes for something like that. And I I think that it is not depend of the brand, it depend of the manager. Okay. Didn't know that. Yes, it is it, it's, it's the same case in, in all all business. Well, well he, I, uh, for, for example, it depends my, of my... the criteria. Yes, say criteria. I don't know. How was I say criteria? Criteria. Criteria. Actually, actually, it's criterion. 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 If it is plural, it is criteria. 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 Okay. Okay. Yes. Taking that is... note. Yes. Okay. The next question is: Were you skeptical about the quality of the product you will receive? Received? Um. Really not because it's full. Yes. Uh, I I just uh, I. Just watch uh, the picture on, uh, online, and that's why I, I is, um, expect to receive. Kind of food, though. Okay. That's what I expect to receive. No sé si así se dice. Eso es lo que espero recibir. Yes, okay, yes. Expect to get. Yes. Yeah. What kind of food, yeah. though? Sorry? What kind of food? What kind of food have you? Uh, ordered? Pollo campero. Uh, oh, okay. Uh, China walk. Yeah, they they don't lie. They don't lie because they are uh, they are formal companies. They don't have to lie. If they lie, you gotta give them a bad review. Yes. Yes. It's like when you when you uh order from uh informal stores or uh, food uh chains or food places. You might get not really, you might not receive what you really order. Yeah, you might, it might be a little different. Yes. Because they are not really, they are not formal stores or, or stores. Sorry, continue. <laughs> okay. Yeah, yeah, got it. <laughs> well, in my case, um, something, uh, Skeptical, yes, skeptical. skeptical. When I bought some uh, phones, for example, so a smartphone or something like a like hair phones or something like that, because for the fake brands, not for the seller probably, you know, for the fake brands, because the 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 prices. It's very high or, or something like that, and, and I don't like to lose a lot of money when I buy when I when I buy something fake, right? But uh, at the end, I try to to get the, the 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 warranty or something like that that to 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 have to support my 
my incomes or support my my the situation and help with helps when I get the product. But yes, uh, something is happening when 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 we when we buy it online. Okay. My so case, the answer very, is uh, sorry. Is is yes. In my yes. case, I am very very skeptical. I do not buy things online that easy. I have to really think about it. I have to invest, do some some a lot of research. I have to see a lot of pictures, mm -hmm. read comments, and that's why I don't really buy online. Honestly, I don't do it. Yes, I don't do. I prefer to go to a store and buy them there, and uh, I don't really buy them online. The last time I bought something online was not really online. It was from an informal uh, person from San Miguel. Uh, I ordered a pair of shoes, some Nike, I don't know the name of them, F1 shoes. They cost me $120, but that was like uh, almost two years ago, yes. And uh, well, I got what 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 I ordered. I got the, I got what I saw on the pictures, but it took me a lot of time to to really make a to make a decision. I was thinking and thinking. I was being very skeptical about it, but I made a decision and I bought the the shoes. But yeah, I I, I don't buy online that much. I don't really do it. I do look for for things online. I investigate prices and everything, but I don't I don't buy online. Okay. Go on, guys. Continue. In around three or five seconds, but if it 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 is um, not there are um a little little bit light. You can the phone thinks like I don't know one or two seconds. It depends. It depends. Yeah. Ah, oh, okay. That's good to know. That's so interesting. <laughs> but and you, the, teacher. What? The teacher. Hello, I'm here. Ah, what I do you prefer, <laughs> iPhone or Samsung? <laughs> I have been using iPhone, or I've been consuming iOS, iPhone, or uh, Apple uh, devices from 2000. Uh, 18 or 2017 yes wow but i started i started my my uh cell phone life with uh, with android yes a long time ago and Me too. Uh, for some reason for some reason i bought an iphone 8 no iphone 6 <laughs> an iphone 6 uh, a long time some couple of years ago so and i liked it now i use iphone so i, I have an iphone here so Yes, I don't. <laughs> Two like, points I, for the iPhone. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Two points for the iPhone. Uh, one point for Diego. <laughs> what happened? What happened to Diego? No, no Apple. She is uh, an Apple girl. Yeah, and he I'm is a, a, a Samsung boy. <laughs> yes, I'm a hater of Apple. Yes. I'm Why? <laughs> Why? <laughs> because. I don't like the the, the system of that. Yes, the I first understand. my 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 almost friends um have the ecosystem, the whole ecosystem, the the watch, mm -hmm. the iPad, the Mac, and the the um, the iPhone. But I don't like oh, it. I I don't like the system. It's really um simple, and I don't like it. And then with with Android, you can customize customize everything that you want. And if you don't like, for example, the 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 type of 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 letters, you can change it. You can change the 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 size. You can change a lot of a lot of things. And then you can download everything yeah. everything that you want. Exactly, you're right. That's you're right. Yeah, that's one. That's one of the things I like about Android. Uh, for, for some reason, I prefer uh, iOS cell phones or Apple cell phones or iPhones 
And I think the, I think that the main reason is because when I had Android cell phones, they they used to get stuck. Yes. And uh, when they get stuck, you know, it's hard and uh, difficult. And this one, they they never get stuck. That's that's why I like I like uh, Apple's Apple cell phones. What's stuck, teacher? Sorry. Stuck like like frozen. Ah, I don't have problems with that. I don't have yeah, problems with it. Depends that. on the cell phone exactly. It depends on the cell phone. Yes. Yes, but if you have an iPhone, you can buy a similar in Android. Yes. No, and... I actually, I actually, I'm thinking, I'm, I'm actually thinking about buying an Android cell phone, uh, because there are some applications I want to have, and I cannot have them in this cell phone, especially the the. When you get the license, uh, that the application don't remember the the name of the application. Yes, and I wanna get the motorcycle at the motorcycle license. So I wanna have the application. I'm um, so I'm going to buy an Android just because of, just be, just for that. Just for that. Yes. Teacher, I can help you. All right. Too. I can help you with that. With I can help you with that with your driver license. Um, let's let's go to to Escopran and. I have friends in there, there in Usulután. Really? Really, yes. Where but are you from, Diego? <laughs> I'm I'm from here for uh, here in San Salvador, but ah, okay. I know um I know the people that's working on the driver schools because I work in a driver school. Oh, all right, all right, all right. And my boss, want, my if you want, boss if you want, is there. Yes. If you want, send me a message through, through WhatsApp. Okay, I can give you the information to right, to give you your right. license. All right, that's good. That's good. Let me see what Magdiel and Raúl are doing. I'll see you right later. If the product doesn't come, if the product Sorry? doesn't come, because if your product doesn't come, yeah. uh, you cannot know. You can't uh, payment or no. So no pagarlo porque no, no llega. <laughs> because in Pedro ya solo only only give coupons the the price. Del precio gastado o de lo que ha gastado, um, I don't know. Are you done with the questions? No, sorry, are you done with the questions? Yes. All right. We're practicing a lot. That's good. Good. That's good. Okay. Thanks. All right. Let me see what what uh, Fabricio and Mauricio are doing. If they are done with the conversation, I'm going to bring them back to the main session as well as you. All right. Okay. Yes. Oh, great. Just work. From Monday to Friday. Oh well, tomorrow will will be hard for me because at the morning I have to work to work at seven a.m. to to five p.m. After that, I, I receive my car and go to the to the verdict. My friend is 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 it is the my friend's birthday, and I okay. don't know. I don't know. And uh, I'm going to worry on Sunday and as well. It's but, 10 uh, or 11 hours working. Wow. Yes, I, I, I'm, I'm working for 10 hours per day. Too much work. Yes, but I got, uh, I have two days to, de to rest day. Monday and Tuesday, right? Monday and Tuesday, yes. Uh, Is that okay, okay for me? Yeah, uh, we, how do you say? Me acostumbro. I'm sorry. 
me acostumbro a, a o sea, se acostumbra a uno. I get used to. used to. I get used to. Yes, I get used to. I get used to. Uh, at the beginning, it was difficult for me because, wow, fuck. Um, then now we're in the, in the in the same building worked, but uh, I remember I started to worry when the pandemic, uh, in the middle of the pandemic, and I really enjoyed the work my work my job, uh, uh, work from home. Yes. And I I, I save money, I save a lot of money because I had all time and I I remember I. I did extra hours all day. Sometimes I were I worked for sixteen hours per day. Wow. Yes. Sixteen hours. Yes, because I I mentioned it, Mauricio, uh, about my job that I'm I'm never talking with my customer. I just I just chat like, like WhatsApp. Nice. Yes, for that reason, for me, it, it's not it's not easy, easy, but it, it's not difficult. Sure. It's different to to speaking every day, and cause probably different to it's not the same. The same thing is different. It's not really like it's just uh, not difficult, not easy. <laughs> I mean, it's it's fine, yeah, right? Yes, I get it. yes. Uh, we're gonna tell go you back to we're gonna something. go back to the main session soon. Sorry, Fabrizio, what do you say? No, I just uh, wanted to tell you something funny uh, that happens yeah. to me uh, several years ago. Uh, sometime I was looking for a job, and my brother uh, get me a job interview. That's mm -hmm. that's right. Just got, uh, me, got me a job interview. Got me a job inter a job interview, and I went to, to I don't know the the name of the call center in in Telefonica's building. Um, and the performance. Um, it was uh, before teleperformance. Concentrics. Uh, no, it was, no recuerdo. Era en el, it was so, convert, it was in convert, the, converges back then. Now it's concentric, I think. The name I don't know there. exactly. Uh, the point is that my my brother uh, didn't tell me the interview was in English. Oh. Um, as I told you, teacher, I I uh, speak in English. I'm not not uh, nada bueno. Uh, I'm I'm better at reading or writing in English. Um, that person who interviewed me uh, started to speak in English and. Uh, I understood every, everything what he said, but uh, when I uh, start to speak, uh, for example, to say where I have been learning the little English I know, uh, I said that uh, at the college uh, for saying uh, the school. Uh, well, uh, he speaks me, uh, or he talks me, or said me a lot of things. Um, I understood everything, but uh, obviously, obviously, he notes uh, that I that I don't speak English. Mm -hmm. I understand, I understand. A pesar de eso, um, lo digo más fácil en inglés, a pesar en español, a pesar de eso, eh, eh, todas esas experiencias a veces un poco que hace ridículo uno. Eh, Como se lo dije en un principio, no me doy por vencido. I never give up. And that's good. That's good. You should never give up. No, and actually, you know, some happy, something uh, funny happened to me in the same place. Uh, was converges back then. 2000, I'm talking about 2017 or 18, like five or six years ago. Uh, back then, I was not really fluent. I mean, it was like you. I could write and I could read and I could understand pretty much everything. But I was not really good at speaking or my fluency was not really good. And also my pronunciation was not really perfect. I had to improve a lot of things. And uh, I went to teleperformance and they gave me, they offered me a position or a job at teleperformance. But I wanted, it was 2016. 2016, I just remembered. 
Yes. Okay. But I wanted I wanted to have a no 2017 17 yes. I wanted to have weekends off, I mean Saturday and Sunday off because I was studying still studying in the university. So I wanted to have a Saturday and Sunday off, but they didn't have they didn't have accounts for 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 that. They had accounts only and they offered the uh, like Tuesday and Wednesdays off. And that was not really good for me. So I said no to okay. the performance. And then I went, I went to convert the same day. A couple of uh, hours later, I went to Converges to see what was going on over there. They had open house that day. So I, I went there and uh, I was with some friends. My friend, uh, he was interviewed. He was the first one to be interviewed, my friend. My friend's English was not really good. His English was, uh, it was okay. Yes. But I was a little better than him. I mean, I'm sorry to say this, but I was a little, a little better than him. And the person, a woman, yeah. it was a woman, a lady. The lady interviewed him. The lady was talking to him in English. I don't know. I don't really know what happened to him. He got very nervous, like extremely nervous. He was shaking, he was shaking and shaking. And the woman uh, was helping him out with the pronunciation. She was correcting him right there in an interview, correcting his pronunciation. So he did poorly in the interview. Very bad. <laughs> he did very bad in the in the, in the <laughs> interview. So I was like thinking, I don't wanna I don't wanna have the interview with this woman. Because it was open house. There were four people interviewing. Four people interviewing. And I was I was I was thinking like I don't want to go, uh I don't want to be interviewed by this person because she was very very uh I don't know angry, uh, and uh, guess what? I was uh, uh she interviewed me, but she did not <laughs> ask me any questions. I just told him, hey, hello, hello, my name is Mauricio. I am from Usulutan, and then the woman thought that I had the same level as my friend. And she did not ask me any questions. And she said, ah, you are with him. And I told him, yes, he's my friend. <laughs> oh, okay. And she said, okay, I'm not going to ask you any questions. I'm going to tell you to improve your English. And I was like, okay, you're not going to ask me any questions. No. She said, okay. I just stood up and left. Yeah, that's what happened to me. I converges. <laughs> it was converges back then. Yeah. And the people uh, was North American, the lady. No, she was not. She was Salvadorian, I know. Yeah. <laughs> But you know that happens. It's okay. It's okay. Bueno, a veces, a veces yo eh, las disculpo porque las entiendo todo y me quedo callado porque no eh, me tardo más en pensar la oración que voy a decir que mejor lo yeah, yeah, hablo yeah. lo necesario. <laughs> Yeah. But it's okay. It, it happens. You go through that. You go through interviews and interviews. Sometimes you do you do well. Sometimes you do poorly, and it's okay. It's just part of a, of a part of it, part of life. Yes. Yeah. And then okay. uh, I was working as a teacher back then, but I was not really, really, really into teaching. Uh, I didn't think I was going to become a good teacher, to be honest. And then I started to work as a teacher in different places. And, uh, well, I'm here. <laughs> I'm here. Pero, déjeme contarle para que se, se anime. Recibí en la mañana la encuesta de, y hablamos con el compañero ahí, de, de esa encuesta de satisfacción. En el caso mío, yo considero que es eh, un excelente profesor, mi estimado. Oh, tiene conciencia y tiene, eh, bueno, para, yo no, no soy gringo, pues, pero la pronunciación la escucho muy bien, la paciencia, eh, cómo nos explica, cómo nos lleva con nos hace participar a pesar de, de pues, las deficiencias que hay. Por lo menos hablo de mi persona y nos deja participar y todo. Y no, no. Eh, pues, eso se hace sentir bien, ¿verdad? Uh, well, thank you. Thank you for saying that, Mauricio. I really appreciate it. Yes. And it, yeah, okay. it, it more, it, what you're saying motivates me to be better, to improve, because you don't know everything. As teachers, 
you don't know everything. You have to continue learning. You learn every day. Well, you, you see, you saw it earlier. I did not know about the word guarantee as a noun. I just knew it was a verb. But you never stop learning. Something easy, but I, I didn't know. I didn't know. I mean, it's okay. It's okay. It's just part of life. Sometimes you, you think you know everything, but you don't. And it, happens in, it happens in everything and everywhere. Exactly, exactly. You're mm -hmm. right. Yes. Right. Okay, teacher. Okay. Uh, we're going to go back to the main session right now. It's time to go back. We just have four minutes left. Let's go back right now. I will see you there in a couple of seconds. Let's go back. all right we're back here and uh well people thank you very much for joining today's session we're about to 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 be dismissed and uh i was uh, monitoring everybody and you guys were participating you were exchanging ideas sharing thoughts and that's something that i really like yes you were not shy. You were speaking, speaking, talking, and oh, that was good. That was good, yes. All of you were practicing and answering the questions. Thank you guys for, for doing that, yes. Uh, on Monday, we're going to continue working with uh, the rest of the session because we did not cover everything, and that's okay. That's okay. Yes. The, we were supposed to cover this part today, uh, how to use report speech. No, not this one, not this one. This one. How to use report speech with information questions. I told you earlier with WH questions, what, where, why, what time, et cetera, all of those. You can see them over here. Yes, you can see them, look. They are over here, when, which, all of them, what. But we do not have uh, uh, time to do that. And that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna do it on Monday. Yes, on Monday. Very good. Uh, do you have any questions, people? Any confusion? Any complication so far? Not teacher. Not in my case. Not in your case. All right. That's okay. It's fine. Me fun. too. So so do I. All right. How is the platform going? Are you working on the platform? No. <laughs> Not yet. Only the session one. <laughs> no. Not this week. Let, let me check. <laughs> let me check. The reason I'm asking you is because today is, uh, <laughs> today is class number nine or session number nine. That means that on Monday, you have to be uh, up to date with the section number two or unit number two, even though we have not finished it yet. Yes. And I can see that some of you have done it. For example, Elizabeth has worked on it on, on the section two, as well as Edgardo. I'm guessing it's Raul, Raul Edgardo. And uh, Marilyn also has worked on it. Mario kind of, yes. I don't see I don't see the rest of you guys. Yes, and the thing is that uh by Monday you have to work on two different things. Let me show you. You gotta work on two different things, and those are the section, the section. I don't know if you can see it. And let me know if you can see it. 
Okay, yes, we teacher. already finished section number one or unit number one. This part is done. Yes. Now we gotta continue by Monday. We gotta have a uh, section number two completed or done. But you also have to do. You gotta do unit number two, eShop initial. But you gotta do the the second thing that we have here, and that is the midterm exam. The midterm exam you gotta do it also by Monday. There are four parts, as you can see, part one, two, three, and four. And uh, it's it's a review of what we have seen, okay? It's a review of the previous exercises, but this is also a requirement to I mean, for, for the next module. You gotta work on the midterm, you gotta work on this, all right? Yes. Again, this has to be done by Monday, it's by Monday. All right, very good, very good. Let me tell you, let me see. I'm gonna tell you who is staying right now. Very Let me update the attendance. Diego Josue Benitez Leiva. Hello, teacher, I'm here. Hello, thank you. Elizabeth Stephanie Vasquez Ramirez. Present. Thank you, Elizabeth. Emerson Alexander Lopez Lopez. Eric Enrique Reyes Martinez. I think he left. Julissa Yamilet Villalta Villalta. She's not here. Uh, Carly Vania Naya Ancheta. I saw her earlier. I think I saw her. Uh, I don't know how long she was here, but I think I saw her. Katia Maria Gonzalez Alvarenga. Present, teacher. Thank you. Luis Fabricio Tobar Ramos. Present, teacher. Thank you. Luis Javier Castillo. Present. Thank you. Magdiel Esaú Garcia Morales. Present, teacher. Marilyn Alejandra Grande Perez. Present. Thank you, Mario Ernesto Ramirez Lopez. No, Mauricio Elgardo Soriano Ramirez. I'm here. And uh, we, we got Raul over here, right? Raul, yes. Yes, I am here. Oh, yes, he, he's there, he's there, yes. All right. All right, people. Well, I, I just wish you the best for this coming weekend. If you're gonna go out with your family or friends or do something with your family or friends, uh, do it, what's the word I'm looking for? Do it carefully, all right? Take care of yourself, enjoy your weekend, try to rest. If you are working, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> if you're working, I'm sorry. Hey. <laughs> Mauricio, I'm sorry. <laughs> You're right. I'm sorry. Well, guys, I will see you on Monday. Have a good weekend. Uh, enjoy, rest, and uh, have fun. All right. Yes. If you drink, if you drink, don't drive. Yes. Be safe. All right. See you guys on Monday. Take care. Thank you, teacher. Bye. Have Thank a you, nice teacher. weekend. Good night, night everyone. Good night. good night, everyone. Good night. Have fun. Enjoy. Enjoy. See you, see you. Bye, teacher. Bye bye, Diego. Thank Take you. care. Have fun. Enjoy your weekend, teacher. I will try. Thank you, Miguel. Thank you. You too. Coach, I have a problem with my homework. Really? Which one? Um, pero mira, le muestro. <laughs> if, you, if you want, you can share the screen, or I can share the screen, no problem. Just tell me, okay. tell me which one it is, and uh, and I will look for it. Yes. Uh, no, 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 no. 
Se ve, no vea. No. Ahora sí. Uh, no, I can see the, the, the menu of your cell phone. Okay, there you go. I can see that. Oh, it's it's loading. Okay. Number no one. Sé uh, he said exercise regularly. He told. Okay, no, no, two, two. He told two. That you, you don't use it. He told me exercise. Sure. He told me to exercise. To exercise yes. regularly. See. Check. Okay, yes. Yes. Ah, um, uh, where did you go to this city? By their my neighbor, my new neighbor. My new Where do you get where do you get that? Where do you get my new neighbor? Yeah, I... oh, okay. The example are uh, above. Okay, my new neighbor. All of them. All right. My new neighbor asked me when. Oh, when I when I move. Uppercase, uppercase. I uppercase. I... Uppercase. In Spanish, is the meaning the chat? Can you see it? Puede ver el chat. Es a u p p e r c a. Ah, uppercase. Uppercase significa mayúscula. Ah, ah. And I had, I had moved. Moved estaba bien, así como con de. I had, recuerde que del pasado se, se reporta como, perdón, pasado siempre se reporta como pasado perfecto, usando el okay. had y, y el participio, sí. Had moved to this city, y el punto final. Yes. Check, maybe, maybe correct, maybe not, I don't know. Yes. And, acá. We went to, we went out last night. She told me. She told me that they gave gone out last night. They had, had. They had. Had Sorry? gone, had, they had. Check. No. They, she told me that. They had gone out last night. Oh, that's correct. We went out last night, she told me. We went? Uh, remove that. It did like that. Okay. Yeah, I don't know. But estaba, estaba correcto. Estaba correcto con el that. Okay. Sometimes uh, it is like that. I don't know why. Okay. Eso es todo. ¿Sabes lo que uh, sí me cuesta un poquito? It's Porque okay. yo estaba en otra academia. Yes. Eh, estaba en Inforce, sí. Pero uh -huh. era como revisar todos los meses lo mismo. Y es como que ahorita me dije, cuando llegué fue como que me dijeron intermedio 3. Uh -huh. eh, quedé con la, el puro de evaluación. Y me dieron un básico 5 y un intermedio, el intermedio 5. Entonces dije que iba a probar con el intermedio, pero ando valiéndole. No, ese, tiene que practicarlo poner un poco más de, de esmero y practicarlo, practicarlo. Eh, lo que le iba a preguntar es... también es sobre si hay libros o lo, algún material, porque literal es como que solo está eh, lo de las tareas y lo que vemos, vea, sí. la diapositiva. Yes. No hay como, un libro. Como si, como libro, como. 
o sobre los temas que vemos? El que usamos, el que, el que, el que comparto es el libro que usamos. ¿Y ese dónde lo encuentro? Te voy a mostrar, ¿no? ¿Sí? <ríe> ok. En la parte, no sé cómo aparece ahí, pero aquí dice, mira, aquí está. Ok. Solo ah. le da clic a esa parte. Creo que ahí le aparece a usted también esa opción. Yeah. Bueno, ahí, ahí está, ahí está el libro. Ahí le aparece. Ok. Lo puede descargar también, no tengo problema. Y también creo, okay. que le envía, lo, creo que le envía al grupo hace un par de, de días. Y lo voy a dar acá, lo voy a, lo voy a re, o reenviar o... o... Creo que fueron las como las diapositivas. No, así está, miren. Ahí le puse un puntito, ¿lo puede ver? Ah, uh, yes, yes, yes. Ajá, le da clic ahí y ahí está el, el, el manual. Perfect. Yes. Thank Eso you, es lo que Paul. se usa. <ríe> yes. Okay. No, Raúl, anime, animo que se siga, siga adelante. Uh, no se, no se agüite. Todo tranquilo. Poco sí, a poco se va, se va avanzando. Sí. sí, ahí trato de, de, de no quedarme, porque ya en la ya llevaba en la otra academia, estaba, digamos, eran 10 meses. En total, eh, todo lo que duraba el curso, yo me había echado 7, ya estando en avanzado. Uh -huh, entiendo, entiendo. Pero era como que empecé desde cero, entonces llegué avanzado en 7 meses, y fue como que de ahí estar viendo lo mismo, lo mismo, lo mismo, fue como que me aburrió, vea. Entonces yo fue como que veo, solo nos enseñaron tres modals, Shul, Cult y Must. Sí, como ese y por sí sí se 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 enfoca más que todo en call centers. Correcto. Entonces, entonces fue como que entonces ahí se usa se, como Shul, Cult y el Must son son palabras formales, entonces uh -huh. se usa mucho eso. Entonces ya y de ahí fue como que donde trabajo, dije, no, ya no voy a decir inglés, que no sé qué. Y quien me dio, quien, o sea, mi jefe me dijo que le estaba la oportunidad. Y me dijo mm. que sí quería intentar. Entonces, yo le dije que estaba bien, vea. Porque eh, como trabajo, estudio en la universidad y aparte llevo esto. Sí. Entonces. Gala, <risa> <risa> no. <risa> Trato, vea, pero. Ahí vamos, ahí vamos. Yes, yes. Just do your best, don't give up, just chin up and keep keep going, keep learning, practice, uh, watch videos, listen to music, everything you do on the social media, try to relate it with English or try to follow page, English pages or pages where, where they share uh, English things, vocabulary, all of it. Yes, they will help you a lot. Okay. Thank you, coach. All right. Raúl, thank you for staying, and uh, well, I will see you on Monday. Have a good weekend, and take care, all right? Good night. Okay. Good night. Bye. Bye.